bread of the Lord. Y'all ain't said nothing this place. Then he shows them the first Illuminati. He shows them, I give you the whole world if you bow down to me. Y'all ain't said, that's why y'all better be careful what type of music you play in your cars and your homes. Some people have bowed down to the devil and he said, if you make me successful, I sell my soul to you. That's why you don't let your teenagers play everything in your house and your car. You got to learn to speak for your own house. He said, listen, as for me and my house, we're going to serve the Lord. So they are in a battle. Uh -huh. And Jesus is counterpunching the devil with the word of God. And so you understand there's power in the word of God. The word of God said, is it not my word like fire, says the Lord, and like a hammer that breaks rocks into pieces? For the word of God is living and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword. So God, I said, Lord, show me, after I get off my 30-day sabbatical, show me what you want me to tell the people. He says, tell the people anytime you have the word and prayer, miracles show up. Yeah. Touch your neighbor and say, just use the word, use the word. and just pray. And just pray. I don't want no catch and I said, well, Lord, let me work it a little bit. Let me preach the Fantastic Four. You know, I said, that's a popular movie. So let me talk about the God, the Father. Then let me talk about the Son and the Paraclete, the Holy Spirit. And then let me put the word on back. He says, no. Tell the people all they need is prayer and the word. He says, we have gotten into a, such a superficial day where people are so, have a, such an itching ear, they want to hear anything cliches, but cliches don't get you through the wilderness. See, the word sent them to the wilderness, but prayer got them out the wilderness. Y'all ain't saying on this way. There's a calling that's on your life that you are destined for the wilderness. You are destined for Gethsemane. And if you don't have the word of God in your life, the devil's going to strip you. I wish I had a praying church in this place. The devil is going to rob you from everything that God intended you to have. Lift your hands and say, I need the word. I need the word.